Hi. Now in the previous part of the question, we had to find the equation of the normal to the curve h at the point p with coordinates minus 3, 3. And this is not drawn to scale, but we found that the equation was y equals 3x plus 12. Now for this next part, it says that this normal crosses the x-axis at the point A and the y-axis at the point B. And we've got to find the length of the line segment AB, giving your answer as a third. So again, as usual, if you'd like to have a go at this and haven't done so, just give you a moment to pause the video. OK, let's see how you got on if you had a go. Well, the normal, we're told, crosses the x-axis at the point A. So this will be the point A. Just put that in there. And it crosses the y-axis at the point B. So that would be B. And we've got to find, then, the length of the line segment AB. So we need to establish what these coordinates are for A and B. So that's our starting point then. Let's start with A. So we'll say at A. Now at A, y would equal 0. So we can just say y equals 0. And all we need to do is substitute this into this equation here. And so we've therefore got 0 equals 3x plus 12. And if I subtract 12 from both sides, then 3x would be equal to minus 12. Divide both sides now by 3, and x would equal minus 12 divided by 3, which is going to be minus 4. So we've got this point then has an x-coordinate of minus 4. Let's just mark that in there. We'll just squeeze it in over there. Clearly, it's not drawn to scale. Now we need to get the coordinates of B. So what we'll do is we'll just border this off and we'll just say at B. Okay, now at B, this is when x equals 0. And when x equals 0, we therefore have y equals 0 plus 12. So in other words, y equals 12. And so just mark that point in there as having a y coordinate of 12. So if we're to get the distance AB, all we've got to do is consider this triangle AB back down to the origin here and across to A and use Pythagoras' theorem. So we can see then that from this, OK, we'll just come down here now, that by using Pythagoras' theorem, we get that the length AB would be equal to the square root of the sum of the squares of these two shorter sides. So this length here is 4 units, so that's 4 squared, and we add this to this side squared, which is 12 squared. 4 squared is 16, 12 squared is 144, so 16 plus 144 is going to be 160. So we've got the root of 160. And it says give your answer as a third. I suppose you can, you can leave it like this, OK? Uh, it's quite acceptable in this answer. It's not saying simplify it fully. But if you did want to carry on, this is the same as the root of 16 multiplied by the root of 10. And the root of 16 is 4. So we just do 4 times the root of 10. Obviously, there won't be any plus or minuses here because we're looking at just the length AB. So we would just take the positive value. So I hope that's given you some idea then if you had any problems on that part of the question. All right.